The first dance genre I started with was, I used to mimic Sarafina. Um, <laughs> and then from then on, I joined a community group by the name of Doros Dancers that is not far from where I live. Um, we did more than dancing. Um, and then later on, I started learning other genres like Gamput, Yopansula, um, your kofifi dance and then it went on and on and on and then I was introduced into the theatre world um, that's when I started to do contemporary and other forms of dance um, including uh, jazz, uh, Afrofusion and ballet. If I've never worked with you as a choreographer then it becomes the first you know, so in all the productions that I did, I've, I've always find motivation behind so that it pushes me, you know, it keeps me on my toes. So um, for me, um, they're all the first and they're all the best productions I've ever done. Do I have a particular style? Um, I don't. Um, hence, I, I said earlier on that um, I'm a very versatile performer and, you know, I love exploring and I don't want to box myself. You know, you hear a lot of dancers, contemporary specifically dancers, saying that um, they've got a voice, you know, they have um, that one particular voice that they, they, they would like to grow, which is, I mean, I believe that um, the more you take in, um, the more you become open to the world out there. And I don't have one specifically. I'm always open to different ideas, different ways of moving and yeah. Our process, uh, firstly, as, as, as a choreographer, for me, it starts with an idea, you know. Um, it starts with a small idea. I pose it to uh, the team and then we see, you know, we discuss it, we interrogate the, the, the idea and then it grows from there. You know, that's where you get to find your theme and, and, and also you, they help you to think as well, you know, they stimulate me because I can never do it alone. And that's how it starts, you know, and then we, we, we start exploring, we start opening it more, more and more. And that's also another way, another form of coming with uh, movements, you know, from that idea, from that small idea. One thing we do as a company, we love using live music. And, and I'll tell you why. I feel that with music and dance, it needs to become, it becomes a marriage. I mean, if, 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 if I'm able to, to move my arm already, I'm making, that's music in me. You know, internal, internally, I'm making music. So we try, we also try by all means, if we use live music to make sure that we are the score, the dancers are the score, not the music. So the musicians needs to follow the dance and that's how we also create music.